2004, Mr. Bobby Stilwell, one of Mr. Pickens' longtime associates, was quoted in Grant's interest rate observer as saying, the thing you have to understand about Boone is that it's all about action. There's no sitting around. So, in recognition of what Mr. Stilwell observed, allow me to focus action today by calling upon our speaker to address this great audience. It's my distinct privilege to introduce Mr. T. Boone Pickens, founder and chairman of BP Capital Management, New York Times bestselling author and creator of the Pickens Plan, a blueprint to reduce America's foreign oil dependence. Good, if we could uh, now begin, we've been in this business for a few years. Hundred. <laughs> but now you seem to have some rather finished ideas about U.S. energy policy. I want to ask you about that, but before, I want to ask you why it is so hard to have a U.S. energy policy. Many presidents of both parties, and both heart parties, when they've been holding power, at different times have found it impossible to come up with a plan. Why do you figure that it's so hard for them? Why don't they just pass the tickets plan? And at least part of your plan is already in one of the bills pending, I think, before Congress now. That's the uh, Carrie Leeson bill. I think that's called the National Power Act. They've got all my stuff in there. And I have the only part of that bill that, uh, that reduces dependency on foreign oil. And it is a security issue with me. This comes down to a security uh, uh, problem. And we've got to start moving to our own resources. Natural gas, yeah, I gave you my story, natural gas. But wind and solar are work. They're expensive. But the way you do that, get in the game. Get an oar in the water. Start to understand <clears throat> what we can do with renewables. People love them. Uh, and, and, uh, and I think uh, the people in this country would cooperate on renewables. They like that idea. And so it's, uh, it can be done, but you have to have the will to do it. This year, they spent over, uh, excuse me, in 18 months, they spent uh, over $200 billion. And they are lining up the oil. They have bought oil in the Canadian oil sands. They bought oil in Brazil, they, uh, Iran, uh, Russia. You name it, they've been there. 23 countries. They have 